These are the items that you will need to turn your full spectrum camera into an IR, infrared, and UV ultraviolet only camera. First you're going to need your full spectrum camera that's already been altered with its filters removed, the underwater case that comes with it, your polarized 3D glasses, small screwdriver set, and a utility knife. Okay, first thing you're going to do is remove all your screws from the lens cover portion of the underwater camera case. There are five of them. Make sure you lay them to the side so that they do not get lost. Once all the screws have been removed, the black cover easily comes off and you open the camera case up and pop out the lens cover and this is what can be used as a template to cut out from the 3D glasses. That's the size that you're going to need to cut out from the 3D glasses and you'll cut one from each lens. As you can see my lens was big enough that I can actually get two circles out of one lens and that's fine also. I traced around the circle that came from the center of the camera cover and now I'll just cut it out with a utility knife. If you're concerned about getting a clean cut, what you can do is take a pair of scissors and after you have rough cut the shape with the utility knife, you can make a cleaner circle with your scissors. I have the two circles now cut out and you can see that when they overlap one way they are clear but when they overlap another way they turn dark. This is the way that you want to put your circles together so that they become a dark filter that will filter out the natural light. To make sure each lens is free from fingerprints I'm going to use a wet wipe to remove all fingerprints and then a soft dry, in this case silk rag, to make sure that all the wetness has been removed. And I'm going to do that for the lens cover and each of the filters that I made. Now that the lens cover and the two filters are each clean, I'm going to hold them by the edges and put them back into place on top of the lens cover on the waterproof camera body. And there I have the lens cover inserted back into the waterproof camera body with the two filters that I just made. Then this piece can be screwed back into place. If you do not have 3D glasses, another thing you can do is use a negative that's been exposed to the light and when it's developed you can see that it is dark and it will help to block the natural light and become a filter for your camera. Once all the screws have been screwed back into place, you can take your full spectrum camera and insert it into its waterproof case and the filter that you've just added will create a UV IR camera as all natural light will be blocked out. And there you have it. Converting the full spectrum camera by using the waterproof case into a true UV IR camera.